my name is Denea and I'm from the Long Beach Public Library. Welcome to today's summer reading program, SRP for short, Toddler Time. We're going to have so much fun today and I just want to let you know at the end of the story time there will be a code that you can add to your Beanstack SRP. So don't forget, but before we start, I got to let you know what I'll be using today. I'll be using a shaker, a scarf, and bubbles today. So keep those handy and I'll let you know when we'll be using them. Now it's time for us to do our hello song and I'll be incorporating sign language with this one. So let's put out our hand and let's touch our forehead and we're gonna go bring it out and that means hello. Let's do that again. Hello, good job. And now we're gonna make the sign language for friends. We're gonna put out both of our fingers and let's bend them and let's give them a hug. Good job. So let's, this means friends. So let's do hello and let's do friends. Good job. And then we're gonna do time. So we're gonna to point to our wrist. Time to say, this is say hello. Let's do that again. Say, hello, friends, time to say hello. Okay, we're gonna do this twice, okay? All right, let's start. Hello, friends, hello, friends, hello, friends, it's time to say Hello. Let's do that again. If you can't do all the moves, at least we can tr work on one at a time. And the more that you do it, the more that you'll, it'll be very easy for you to do. Okay, so let's do it again. Hello, friends. Hello, friends. Hello, friends. It's time to say hello. Okay, let's do the sign language of all the things that we learned to get today again. So, hello, friends, time, say, and then hello. Good job. We'll work on it again next time. Okay, it's time for us to do some stretches. Let's get our arms ready, let's shake them out. And we're gonna reach them up high, we're gonna stretch, stretch, stretch your arms high above your head, okay? So let's start. Stretch, stretch, stretch your arms high above your head. Stretch so high, reach the sky, then we'll stretch again. Let's do it again. Stretch, stretch, stretch your arms high above your head. Stretch so high, reach the sky, bring them down again. Okay, let's do it again. Okay, let's get our arms ready. Okay. Stretch, stretch, stretch your arms high above your head. Stretch so high, reach the sky, then we'll stretch again. Let's bring it on down and stretch it up. up and up and let's do it again stretch 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 your arms high above your head stretch so high reach the sky bring them down again oh my arms are feeling a little limber okay let's do another one we're going to stretch to the windows stretch to the door stretch to the ceiling and bend to the floor okay so we're going to go out in, up, down. Are you ready? We're gonna do this twice. Okay, stretch to the windows, stretch to the door, stretch to the ceiling, and bend to the floor. <laughs> okay, let's get our arms ready. We're gonna do it one last time. Okay, stretch to the windows, stretch to the door, Stretch to the ceiling and bend to the floor. Good job. Yay! We'll be doing the wheels on the bus. 
So let's get our arms rolling and let's start. The wheels on the bus goes round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus goes round and round all through the town. The horn on the bus goes beep, beep, beep. Beep, 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 beep. The horn on the bus goes beep, 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 all through the town. The doors on the bus go open and shut, open and shut, open and shut. The doors on the bus go open and shut, all through the town. The wipers on the bus go swish, 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 swish. The wipers on the bus go swish, 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 all through the town. The babies on the bus go wah, 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 wah. The babies on the bus go wah, wah, wah all through the town. And now we're going to say the parents. The parents on the bus go shh, 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 shh. The parents on the bus go shh, 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 all through the town. Today, we'll be singing a song about the color orange. We'll be singing this song twice. And I have my orange hat and the word orange is in the color orange. So we're going to be spelling out the word orange and we're going to say pumpkins are always orange, oranges are always orange, and then we're going to spell out orange once again. So it's going to be to the tune of the wheels on the bus. Okay, so let's start. O-R-A-N-G-E, O-R-A-N-G-E. O R A N G E, orange is what that spells. Pumpkins are always orange, oranges are always orange. O R A N G E, O R A N G E. That was really fun. Let's do that again, okay? So we're just spelling out the word orange. And orange is what that spells. And pumpkins are always orange. And oranges are always orange. And then we're going to spell out the word orange again, okay? So let's start. O R A N G E. O R A N G E. O R A N G E. Orange is what that spells. Pumpkins are always orange. Oranges are always orange. O R A N G E. O R A N G E. Good job. I hope you had fun spelling and singing the song about orange. For today's flannel rhyme, I'll be singing about dinosaurs. And we're going to be singing about how a dinosaur went out one day on a giant fern to play. She had so much fun, she called for another dinosaur to come. So when we call for the dinosaur, we're going to go, oh, dinosaur. And then we're going to slap our legs like another dinosaur is coming. And then we're going to see another dinosaur come. But let's practice the counting to number five. We're going to go one, two, three, four. Five. All right, I think you're ready. Okay, so we're going to put up our first dinosaur and let's put out one finger and that's going to be one dinosaur, okay? One dinosaur went out one day on a giant fern to play. She had such enormous fun. She called for another dinosaur to come. Oh, dinosaur. Oh, I hear another one coming. And that makes two. One, two. 
two dinosaurs went out one day on a giant fern to play. They had such enormous fun, they called for another dinosaur to come. Oh, dinosaur! Let's slap our legs. Whoa, I hear another one coming. And that makes three. One, two, three. Three dinosaurs went out one day on a giant fern to play. They had such enormous fun. They call for another dinosaur to come. Oh, dinosaur. I hear another one coming. Ooh. Let's count our dinosaurs. One, two, three, four. Four dinosaurs went out one day on a giant fern to play. They had such enormous fun. They called for another dinosaur to come. Oh, dinosaur. Let's hit our lap. Oh, good job. And that makes five. Let's count it out. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Five dinosaurs went out one day on a giant fern to play. They had such enormous fun. They played until the day was done. And now let's count to five again, okay? So go one, two, three, four, five. Good. Okay, it's time for us to get our shakers out. If you don't have any shakers, hopefully you have something that'll make some noise while we sing the ABCs. We're gonna shake our shakers, okay? So let's test out our shakers or anything that makes noise. We're gonna go all in a circle. We're gonna shake it really fast. Ooh, shake it really slow. And we're gonna shake it really quietly. Can you do that? And shake it really loud. <laughs> Very good. And now we're gonna do our ABCs. We're gonna sing this song twice, okay? So let's get the rhythm going. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? Let's shake it all around. Shake it really fast. Shake it slow. And let's go. Do it one more time. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? Good job. And now we're going to shake our shakers. We're going to do this song twice, okay? We're going to go shake your shaker, shake, 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 shake your shaker, shake, shake, shake. Shake your shakers. Good job. And now we're going to shake it high, high, high. Let's raise it above our head. Okay. Shake your shakers high, high, high. High, high, high. High, high, high. Shake your shakers high, high, high. Shake your shakers. And now we're going to shake our shakers low. So we're going to do it below our head, okay? So now we're going to start. 
Shake your shakers low, 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 low. Shake your shakers low, low, low. Shake your shakers. Good job. You want to do that again? Okay, let's do it. Shake your shakers. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake your shakers, shake, 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 shake your shakers. Now we're gonna shake it high, high, high. We're gonna shake it above our head, okay? All right. Shake your shakers high, 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 high. Shake your shakers high, high, high. Shake your shakers. And now we're going to shake it low. So we're going to shake it below our head, okay? So we're going to start. Shake your shakers low, low, low. Low, low, low. Low, low, low. Shake your shakers low, low, low. Shake your shakers. Good job. We'll be doing a song about colors on my flannel. So we're gonna start off with a color red and it's to the tune of head, shoulders, knees, and toes. And we'll be doing this song twice, okay? So we're gonna start. Red, yellow, green, and blue, green, and blue. Red, yellow, green, and blue, green, and blue. Orange, purple, brown, and black. Red, yellow, green, and blue, green, and blue. Okay, let's do that again. Red, yellow, green, and blue, green, and blue. Red, yellow, green, and blue, green, and blue. Orange, purple, brown, and black. Red, yellow, green, and blue, green, and blue. Today, I'll be reading Bronze Arena by James Howe, illustrated by Randy Cecil. Brontorina. Brontorina had a dream. I want to dance. But you were a dinosaur, Madame Lucille pointed out. True, Brontorina replied, but in my heart, I am a ballerina. As you can tell, look it, she's on her tippy toes like a ballerina. She is too big, said one girl, and she does not have the right shoes, said another girl. Madame Lucille wondered what to do. She had never had a dinosaur as a student before. Dinosaurs were rather large, and this cer one certainly did not have the right shoes. But then she felt Clara and Jack tugging at her skirt. Oh, please, they pleaded. Madame Lucille looked into the dinosaur's eyes. What is your name, my dear? Brontorina. Brontorina Apatosaurus. I even sound like a dancer, don't you agree? Madame Lucille did agree. How could she not? Welcome to Madame Lucille's Dance Academy for girls and boys, she said. Please, try not to squash the other dancers. Music, Magnolia, she commanded the piano player. As Magnolia began to play, Madame Lucille turned her commands to her students. Plié, relevé, arabesque, jeté. Oh no, look at Brontorina. She keeps hitting her head on the ceiling. But it looks like she's doing such a great job. What a graceful dancer you are, my dear, Madame Lucille exclaimed. Brontorina blushed. On the outside, I am a dinosaur, but in my heart, you are a ballerina, cried Clara and Jack. 
She still doesn't have the right shoes, said another girl. In the weeks that followed, you can see what happened. Look, there, the little girls are like, look out, help. Hey, watch your tail. The piano. It seemed like Bronterina was really big. And she was getting in the way. Oh, Bronterina, cried Madame Lucille. I'm afraid you are too big to be a ballerina. You barely fit in my studio. And how in the world will a male dancer ever lift you over his head? I could do it, Jack shouted. No, my dear, said Madame Lucille with a sigh. You could not. A tear fell from Bronterina's eyes. Downcast, she turned to leave. Wait, Clara called out. Don't go. My mother has been working on a surprise for you all week, Bronterina. She is bringing it today. Whatever are you talking about, Madame Lucille asked Clara. Just then, Clara's mother appeared at the door. You must be Bronterina, she said, holding out the surprise. I hope these will fit. What do you guys see? I see some ballerina shoes. Well, now she has the right shoes, said the one girl. Bronterina beamed. They fit perfectly, she cried. I am a ballerina, or I would be if only I weren't so big. Oh, fiddlesticks, said Madame Lucille. Why didn't I see it before? The problem is not that you are too big. The problem is that my studio is too small. And so the whole class went off to look for a studio big enough to hold all of Bronterina's talent. They went into a building and it was too small. And they went into a barn and it was still too small. Yeah, still too small. But then Jack, I have an idea. Now, Madame Lucille's Dance Academy had room for everyone. And, it's, and there it is, a sign, Madame Lucille's Outdoor Dance Academy for girls and boys and dinosaurs and cows. Look, we have all, we have cows, and there's dinosaurs coming in. It's like, I want to dance. Then you must, my dear, said Miss Madame Lucille. And it all began with a dream. The end. Let's get our hands ready for if you're happy and you know it. So let's rub our hands together really fast. And let's start. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet, stomp, stomp. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet, stomp, stomp. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet, stomp, stomp. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. Good job. It's time for some bubbles. I hope you're ready and you have your bubbles ready to go. I have two songs for you. We counting our bubbles. We're gonna do one little, two little, three little bubbles. And then there we're gonna sing, there are bubbles in the air. And there are bubbles in your hair. So we're gonna start. So let's get our fingers ready and our bubbles. So let's start blowing our bubbles. And have them all floating around us. And keep blowing. And then now we're gonna count. Okay, let's start. 
One little, two little, three little bubbles, four little, five little, six little bubbles, seven little, eight little, nine little bubbles, ten little bubbles go pop, pop, pop. Good job. Let's pull a little bit more. And, ooh, those ones are big. And then we're gonna do their bubbles in the air. There are bubbles in the air, in the air. There are bubbles in the air, in the air. There are bubbles in the air, there are bubbles in your hair. There are bubbles in the air, in the air. Okay, job, let's pull some more. And let's sing this last song again. There are bubbles in the air, in the air. There are bubbles in the air, in the air. There are bubbles in the air. There are bubbles in your hair. There are bubbles in the air, in the air. All right. Good job, everybody. It's time for us to say goodbye. We got to say our goodbye song before we go. And we're going to do it very similar to how we did the hello song. But instead of saying hello, we're going to say goodbye. And this is goodbye in sign language. So we're just going to replace hello with goodbye. Okay? So we're going to sing this song twice. And we'll do our sign language. Okay, you ready? Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. Let's do that one more time. Okay, let's get say goodbye. Friends, time to say goodbye. Okay, you ready? All right. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. All right. I'll see you next time. I hope you enjoyed today's story time, and I look forward to seeing you guys again soon. But don't forget, there's a code at the end of the story time to add to your Beanstack summer reading program. Keep reading.